Hi everyone, I'm Andrea Eldridge from Nerds on Call and callnerds.com for eHow.com, here today to talk about removing duplicate songs from iTunes. iTunes is a great manager for your music and video files, but when things go wrong, it can take forever to get it working right again. To remove duplicate songs manually, select File in the top menu and scroll down to Display Duplicates. Don't click it just yet, there's actually a secret option that isn't very obvious. With your mouse hovering over Display Duplicates, press the Option key. See how the option changes to Exact Duplicates? Now simply highlight a song you want to remove and press Delete on your keyboard. If you have a bunch to remove, you can select more than one track by highlighting the first song, then holding the control key while you click other songs you'd like to remove. Doing this song by song can get a bit tedious, particularly if you have an extra large collection or you accidentally duplicated your entire library. For the heavy lifting, I like to use a free program that will automatically find and remove duplicates called Gizmo Trim. Sorry Mac users, this one's just Windows. When you open the program, iTunes auto launches, if you don't already have it open. Click the big magnifying glass in the top left corner for Gizmo Trim to start looking for duplicates. Once the search is done, just click the scissors icon to remove them. If you delete something by mistake, your songs will be in your recycle bin to recover. That is until you empty the trash can. For more information on how to remove duplicate songs from iTunes, check the links on this page. I'm Andrea Eldridge from Nerds on Call and callnerds.com for eHow.com. Thanks for watching.